Hello everyone, my name is Randolph, and tonight I am Tony, where, where is Tony, okay. I'm your evaluator, and I think Tony did some really good points tonight, like for opening, he bring us a really recent uh, news about the Cubs winning the first championship in 108 years, and we point out the interesting fact that our government wasn't even exist at that time, it was Qing Dynasty. And then you show us some examples from uh, 1908 to to that uh, 2016, which is now. And I think it gave us more concept about how long 1908 is, how, how long is the time is far from this. Because well, I'm majoring in history, but I, I can't really imagine what kind of life people live in 1908 and you also put I don't I don't know if it's actually your picture but <laughs> 1995 yeah I think everyone know is his birthday and one more good thing that you did is your slides you gave us um, a lot of pictures instead of instead of um, words and those black and white pictures those vintage I think is my favorite part and well, here comes the improvement part. And firstly, I would like to talk about some phrase that you can improve in your speech. Like what you say, you said, um, when you're introducing the background from 1908 to 2016, you said, let me take some example. But I think it's better you to put, let me show you some examples, because take some examples isn't quite the um, normal way that we use in a sentence. And when you say Anna tried to get family together and they have been divine during the civil war. But divine is quite like you divine the whole thing, like a circle and you divine into a few parts. But in family, I think we people are individuals, so we cannot use separate more often. So you can say you, they have been separated during the Civil War. And when you bring up the Olympics, you said it was held in Rome, Italy, but when you talk about nation, it's very used Ita um, Italy, not Italian. And, um, oh, and you said Anna wrote hundreds of letters to the authorities. A letter which means they're garbage. So you say they write garbage to authorities, but it's actually letters, right? Because I've read your, uh, your script, so. Okay, I um, think I don't have much time left. So some cliche things like manage your stage, because you know tonight out there is very loud, so you can get closer to the audience so everyone can hear you. And I think the microphone is off, so. Uh, next time, it's better that we all check the equipment and also make sure that the venue won't be uh, influenced by other activities. And do I still got time? Oh no. <laughs> okay, back to G.